Oh, hey there. Welcome to the Expert on YouTube. I'm your expert for YouTube, dandanowski.com. But I don't actually work for YouTube. It's just on YouTube. I work for adva.com. We put the videos. You know how it works. Anyway, uh, today's question is, what is the difference between vented and ventless gas logs? Oh, okay. So they're both uh, faux wood logs that you put in your home and they make fire and they keep you warm and they look nice, which is the main reason why people get them. I mean, most people are going to have a furnace or boiler or heat pump or something to stay warm, but they get the gas logs because they're like, ooh, ooh, it's nice. Yes, it's like Christmas, honey. Yes, the children's love it, but tell them not to touch fire. Anyway, so what's the difference, right? Uh, well, the big difference is vented logs must have ventilation, ventless don't, hence the name. Uh, vented logs are mainly gonna use something like a chimney. So if you have an existing fireplace with a chimney, that could be ideal for vented logs. Uh, obviously the chimney has to be functional, but the benefit there is that Vented logs look really good. They look the most like real wood burning logs. Uh, and vented logs can be a little more affordable. Uh, the downside, of course, they create carbon monoxide, which is nature's deadly killer, that and a puma, but that can be safely vented, you'll be fine. Ventless logs, okay? So you don't have to have no chimney. You can put them anywhere, reasonable. Uh, they're a little more expensive. They don't look quite as good, but you don't have to have ventilate them. So if you don't, if you have a newer home, don't have no chimney, then, you know, in addition to not being visited by Santa Claus, you can get ventless logs. Now, one other downside is that uh, they can't create excess moisture, ventless logs can. So if you have a problem with internal humidity already in your home, I would not recommend getting them. But other than that, they're okay. Okay, bye. Hey, do you have questions about how Santa Claus gets into your house illegally? Then just ask in the comments below. Okay, bye.